Hi everyone, this is Video Reborn. This is a video review on the HD Zune, Zune HD's App Store Marketplace versus the iTunes App Store. This is a head-to-head -head combat. And let me tell you, Zune HD has to shy away if you care about apps and mobile computing on one device, GPS, stuff like that, iPhone. If you don't have uh, money for the data plan, iPod Touch for the um, cool CPU, cool games, 3D card, dedicated 3D card, third-party support, uh, 70,000 apps and growing, iTunes with millions of songs, if you want to go for a legal way, okay, there's always a way for illegal activities. Um, if that's the case, that's you, um, I believe that um, both players should suit you, okay, but if you really care about um, apps go for the iPod touch and iPhone if you care about HD quality um, movies HD radio um, pictures marketplace uh, show show Xbox uh, some Xbox live games um, in the future Zoom HD Zoom HD is very promising though okay just to let you know now this video I will show you the marketplace first of the Zoom um, there's currently only music and apps while the um, Apple iPod Touch, they I I, uh, I would just say iTunes, okay? They have iTunes and App Store. They separate two things. So um, let's go to the App Store, which everybody cares first. Unfortunately, uh, Microsoft has uh, not released any. I don't think they're going to release any um, service de development software development kit for developers. So uh, third-party developers, and these are all in-house apps weather texas hold'em sudoku um space battle 2 which is a shoot them up games a shell game which is uh like a guess moving objects head sick i think a lot of people knows that and then the um chess and the goose flat which is a multi-touch game where you have to kill all these germs man this it's the app store and as you see it's a mobile computer so um, do not compare directly iPod touch to Zune okay Zune can compare directly to iPod Nano because they are all music players multi multimedia mu uh, players okay PMP portable media player iPod touch and iPhone they are mobile computers so you compare iPod touch or I should say iPhone with Windows mobile device okay iPod touch and iPhone with Windows mobile device again okay so again App Store definitely Apple okay if you care about songs in a legitimate way iTunes okay iTunes let's look at the music I'll show you the apps if I have time okay um, but currently I'm going to show you uh, the music Music has to relate to radio. I'll show you what's going on when something cool about the Zoom HD radio feature uh, where you can um, spend more money actually. Okay, iTunes is cool. Uh, free music every week, music video every week. Um, the subscription base of Zoom it's a uh, $14.99 per month where you can download unlimited, um, I mean, download basically all the songs and keep 10 permanently into your library. So basically, if you pay um, fifteen dollars a month and continuously for twelve months, all right, that's hundred eighty dollars total. You get a, a, a whole year of millions of songs, all right, and you get to keep uh, one hundred and twenty songs a year permanently in DRM free MP3s. Zoo, I mean, so iTunes, okay, iTunes is pay by each time okay you do pay one time one song for like what 99 cents one dollar 29 cents you know um, all these things this is just a different subscription base so um, I would just say that the store library zoom it's not it's like half the size of iTunes but Amazon has a lot more. So Amazon stock songs can actually put inside the Zoom HD, but Amazon's video on demand might not able to put on the Zoom HD. Please verify that. Uh, probably not because um, I'm not sure actually. Okay. Hopefully they can. But um, yeah, 
Now, iTunes also has a movie on the phone or the uh, mobile computer. Not soon HD yet. I really hope they have Netflix. If they have Netflix, I'm sure, definitely sure that Zoom HD will sell crazy too, you know. Netflix subscription streaming, streaming HD movies. Whoa. Not yet. Currently it's just music and apps, as you know. So um yeah. Now when you want to buy a song in Zoom, you click on it. Click on the song. You can also play it. Play it in the background, all right. And you can actually keep buying. I mean, uh, adding things to your cart. Like um, this one, I add two albums. All right. Now go back to the cart. Now you have this album here. It uses Microsoft points, which is 80 Microsoft points to one US dollar. So do your math. This is around 99, sorry, 9.99 uh, for the this Microsoft Points, 711 Microsoft Points. Clear the songs, album. You clear your card and you pay everything at the end, just like you do it on the uh, any online store. iTunes, as I say, you pay it one by one, and you don't have a shopping cart. And uh, one thing cool about these uh, iTunes is the if you're a college student, iTunes U is very helpful. Okay, they got lectures, podcasts, and stuff like that. This is very student friendly, let me tell you. Um, Zoom HD is not really. It's like, a, what's up, yo? On a street, you want some street, yo? That's that kind of style. So it's a totally different approach. Um, Microsoft is smart to not directly engage Apple like that. All right. Apple has like 75% market share, everybody knows, or more, or crazy thing. Zoom is like, I don't know, 1%, 2%, not even that. We'll see. But Zoom HD is very promising with the NVIDIA Tegra chipset. So that's about it. Um, now I have some time, I'll show you radio. Radio, once you listen to a channel and you like the song, okay, like this, all right? Wait for a while, recognize the HD channel, the song's name. This song is not in the Zune database, just to let you know. But it's kind of like Pandora or the uh, uh, Tune Wiki. I really hope that uh, Zune HD will have something, some kind of app, like internet um, recognizer app in this uh, device, hopefully in the future. And um, once you add to the cart, you go to Marketplace. And you can actually, if they have it in the database, you can buy it. But it says error, uh, items not found, so you just delete it. Uh, but th this is a really cool feature, right? You like the songs from the radio, just like Pandora, you love it, you tag it. After you tag it, you can buy it. Own the song. It's own you, man. <laughs> yeah, you got a search engine, say, I don't know. I say, sup, man. Superman, I don't know what's that. International super hit. That's the marketplace search engine. Same thing as the iTunes, okay? iTunes has a search engine too. Um, yeah, it has a TV shows. <laughs> Not iTunes yet, all right? Okay, now I say, oh yeah, I'll add everything. Yeah, add again. And um, I'm gonna quit, quit, go to cart. I'm not gonna buy anything using Microsoft Points. Now, let's take a look at the apps that I have downloaded. People thought about, um, you know, uh, long loading time, unlimited access to million songs. Man, it's a new ad again. It's a different ad this time. Every time it's a different ad, you know? That's cool, but I, I really wish when they load stuff, why not use the time to show ads? This is just a checker game, so... Um, just to play some chess. Um, let me show you the other app. See, quitting the app takes a long time. All right, it's like an emulator running under the Zoom software. This is a multi-touch game. Oh man, again, Zoom Pass now. It's not the Kia, um, whatever app. Before you have to force to watch a video of Kia, um, the, you know the car, Korean car. See, loading, come on man, use the loading time to do what? 